Well, good morning. Welcome back to the airport. We're on day 66 of our Darkness Falls series. Thought I heard some scuffling around. So look, there's somebody out for their morning jog outside the airport. Hopefully they won't, you know, bring in any of their friends. There's a few asleep somewhere up in here. I don't know where. Uh, I'm guessing they're on level, but I don't necessarily know exactly where. So we didn't do anything last night besides just you know, hang out in the kitchen and try not to make any noise. I did peek my head in the bathrooms here because I forgot to look at those. I think there was like one zombie. Um, I, let me turn that back on so you guys can see. We didn't... Okay, I'm not sure what's up with the lock picks there, but this door, I don't know if there's another way to get to it from where we are. I have no idea. We'll just have to see what's on the other side. <laughs> okay. A refrigerator. Hey, some vegetable soup. You know what? I'll go ahead and take you. Thanks, game. That's nice of you. And an old stove. Some Okay, uh, well, this is going to be loud, but... Oh. Okay, so this is a room I've not been into yet. Quietly now. Okay, okay. There's, there's a few people in here. I'm not sure if there's a, another way to go, like maybe into that little window up at the top there. We're going to try to do this. Uh, we're going to try to do this like we did the rest of the time here. To get our sneak on. Danger, Will Robinson. Shh. See, that, that looks like a tall Sylvia. That one looks like, hey, what are you, stay down, dude. No. All right, there's a regular Sylvia. Shh. Don't wake up your big sister. Wow, Wario up there. All right, so then there's Skeletor in the kitchen, in the uh, corner up there. Dude can take some shots, that's for sure. Uh, that does look like a big, uh, a bigger Sylvia. Dude just so mad he's gonna punch the chair. Don't hit Sylvia. Don't wake her up. You big maroon. You know what happens if you wake her up? She gets pissy. See, I'll show you. And but uh, on on her behalf, she did poop out a big bag. So let's see. Is there? A Oh, okay, so in the bathroom that I kind of stuck my head in last night, there's a wall. Okay, so that's the correct way to go about getting in here. Nice. Cool. Can a picture? I'll take you. Why not? Let's see what Sylvia brought us here. Money. Thanks, Sylvia. Muchos appreciations. Did you make me some coffee? You did not make me any coffee. Disappointed, lady. Disappoint. That's big double doors. Hold on. Let's double check make sure there's nothing else. What's what's in here? <gasps> Ooh. The pantry. All right, well, we got to go up in there real quick. Get our gun back. Let's see. We're down to 150 rounds in. A oh, hey. What the hell are you? Big beefer. That's what you are. No. You startled me. I'm not going to lie. I'm not going to lie, Frank. That's all you had was a little hat? Hang on. We got some body bags over here. Are y'all storing bodies in here? Because that's just weird. I mean, maybe this is like the refrigerated room and you're trying to keep things fresh why do you want to keep them fresh frank what do you have planned for these man i don't think i want to know i'm not, i don't i'm take back my question i don't want to know i'm guessing everything i'm going to find in here is going to be food related which makes sense since it kind of is the pantry take both of those i'll leave the flowers behind i have faith that we're going to complete this airport today whether that means we're going to be alive when we complete it wrong tool uh when we complete it or not that remains to be seen we'll just have to see we may have to flee but you know what i, I have faith that we're going to make it through there so you know big thanks to everybody who's been watching the videos truly do appreciate it of course um you guys are absolutely awesome much love and support on the series so far to be 66 days into this and still having you guys hang out and give me grief for when i miss things do things wrong forget things or almost die so i appreciate it truly do okay so this looks like it's taking us down into a bad spot okay all right that looks like security that looks like some security we got some sealed shipping crates here let's go check Ooh, hang on where do you go okay there's a tiny little bit of a frame drop going on why do i feel like there's a whole bunch of zombies that just spawned in Check the check our little. All right, so there's zombies out and about. They're on the same level as us. They're just not awake right at the moment. And they're not in here. Nice. Okay, we'll check out all these cardboard boxes. See if we can get anything fun in any of these. Okay, we did not find anything fun in any of those boxes. We found a little bit of lead, maybe a little bit of plastic. I'm not even sure if we found that. A little bit of lead, a little bit of cloth. There's a little bit more lead, which we'll need for making our own ammo. Sure, I'll take you. I'm leaving the dies behind. 
Eh, I'll take all that stuff with me too. Okay, well, uh, we need to crack into these boxes here. They're sealed shipping crates, so if I remember correctly, these not going to have much in them. Never mind. I misremembered, and I'm very, very happy about that. Ba okay, I don't need you. I can take you. Do I have enough room in this bat for any other mods? Not at all. Okay, never mind. I thought I might. What about in either any of these? That one's got three, that one's got four, that one's got three. So let me see if I can slap another mod on here, just to kind of keep some inventory space open up. I don't think it'll let me put the barbed wire on anything besides clubs, which I only have the one of, so it's not going to let me put it on anything else. That's that's okay. Let's see what... All right, we got, we got some stuff in there. See if we can do this like quiet-like. We'll just crack in here and... We're going to do this kind of our own way today. <laughs> That's just how we do everything. And we got some toms. Did you reload your gun lately? Oops, I shot the wrong tom. I'm sorry, tom. Can I? Nope. I need, I need to be able to peek in here. Is there anybody else in this room? If, I don't think there is. Okay, there's a safe on the wall. We definitely have to go get that. And, of course, the little baggie that he dropped. Genosis, I need you to stop bouncing off of things. You're making me jumpy, sir. Money! And I'll just scrap those since I do have some cloth. In. Okay. Oh, there's a way into the room. I wonder if I'm supposed to go about doing this a different way. And, hey, maybe you fall into the roof into the office and ta-da, there's a safe. Well, we're doing it wrong, but I'm, we're trying to be safe as much as possible. Now, I will say, because there have been people asking me, whatever, if I'm going to go back and finish doing the rocket. Yes, absolutely. Now, of course, the challenge is going back over there before everything respawns and makes it even more challenging on the upstairs. Okay, seriously. Uh, make it more challenging on the upstairs portion of it to have to go through all that again, even though there's a chunk of the upstairs that's missing. Nice. And auto rifle's not cool. So we will definitely be going and finishing that up at some point in the very near future. I... You fear not. Let me, just fear not, okay? We are definitely going to be doing that. Uh, we just needed to try out a different POI. Why do I feel like things are going to fall on the ceiling? Hang on. Are you growling at me, Genosis? Don't you dare growl at me. Some random cement mixer. Sure, I'll take that. I, yeah, I'll go ahead and take that other stuff too. If nothing else, I can always drop it if I get full. A beaker, that's at least worthy of selling. This is where they keep all their destroyed stuff. Every one of the workbenches is in here. And they're all busted all to hell. I blame Frank. Just gotta find some way to hide all the bodies, right? Oh good. XP was great. Shh. Stay down, Glenn. Stay down. Hang on. Gotta reload. It's the arrival of the janitors. I said stay down, sir. Y'all broke all the cabinets and then decided to hang out in this little cabinet. I'm just going to scrap you. I could get 116 monies for it. Gently now. Let me guess. That goes to the roof. We got some working stiff crates up in here, though. That could be kind of cool. Maybe we could find some. I don't even know what I might want to have in here. Eh. If nothing else, maybe we get some skill notes. And y'all, I can sell for just just a little bit. Do you go up on the roof? You do. Am I supposed to be going this way? I don't feel like I am. I don't feel like I'm supposed to be here yet. I feel like everything is about to go really bad and I'm going to have to run and jump off the top of this place. <laughs> so let's tiptoe around, see if there's anybody sleeping in any of these random corners. I see a hole in the ceiling over there. That... Looks maybe there's some stairs going down. There was a flashlight when we came out pointing a ways. Maybe we can get to the air traffic control tower from up here. We're going to check to make sure any of these corners isn't chocked full of idiots that are going to spawn in and start running at us the moment we decided to make any noise whatsoever, though. A little bit safe. We'll play a little bit safe today. Okay, so that is the office that we were in over there. Uh, here's some stumbling around over there, but I'm not gonna go. I'm not gonna worry about them and try and shoot the idiots out on the ground. Last night, I, I oh, there's a bird, stupid bird. Um, last night I didn't do anything at all. I hung out inside the kitchen, and I guess eventually, as I was saying in the video, I'm guessing that eventually what happened was all the idiots that showed up last night, right before the end of the episode, decided to despawn because I didn't do anything. Fortunately, let's see what we have in here.
First try. Um, besides just a little bit of garbage, there's nothing in here. Ha Wait, that's the... Okay, so that's the stairs we went... Okay, all right. So this is the elevator shaft that we were... Right there is the stairs we went down. Okay, cool, cool. Well, I'm not going to go back down that way, but I guess in the situation of an emergency, if I need to run, I can run and just slam the door, drop down and tiptoe underneath the rails, and maybe that'll slow them down. I'm making my way towards this air traffic control tower and seeing if maybe that's the way we're supposed to go. Kind of seems like it could. Although there's a big spotlight pointing right there, so maybe that's leading me where I'm at. Or where I'm supposed to go. Maybe? Is that your way of saying I need to go this way? You could point that way. Whoa. We got a disco. Something's tripping balls here. Um, It's doing that thing it was doing out front. Ooh, I see books and stuff and things. Wait, uh, hang on. Yeah, hang on. Hang on. Before I decide to do that, there's other little buildings. Hold on, we got a stupid bird right there. Uh-oh, that was a stupid hey, look, glowing bird. Zombies. And there's one right over there. And one right there. I'm trying to keep the stupid birds out of my problem area because they will jump up in here. No. Just like that. They will jump up, slap me, and I'll be stuck with an infection and have no idea what to do next. Now, of course, drone over here, uh, Genosis is uh, chocked full of first aid and stuff, so I think I'd be alright. But still, I'd really, really not have to use it and get hit by a bird, because it never fails. Every time I'm in a POI and a bird decides to jump on me, that's when things go horrible. Err. Horrible err. This is the inside of the elevator shaft, too. It looks like there's a ladder going down over there. Oh, good. The sun went, uh, or the sun came back out. Stupid birds. So far, so good. God, don't say stuff like that, Cap. So it looks like there's a door right over there, but it looks like there's some metal or some spiked wood blocking it here. So we may not be able to get into that one without making our own entrance. Do all of these lead to elevator shafts? Kind of looks like it. Again, if things go terrible and I need to evade and r uh, run around and hide a little bit, I guess I can. Oh, sorry, I didn't see it there. My bad, bird. My bad. Is this door even unlocked? Well, tell you what. It's about to be. Hey, look, it's unlocked. Uh-huh. Go ahead and remove you so I can get back out of here without getting the old bleed. All right, into... We're near the top of this. Wait, can I go in there? Money. Please be money. Money. Oh, Six dollars. That's it. Okay, we're near the top of this tower, so we're going to go up into the actual control area first. Hold on, let's make sure that there's nothing like right up here is going to run at me as soon as oh, I... Oh, good. XP with legs. That. That's exactly why I decided to peek upstairs. If I opened the door and Carl decided to get all excited and run at me, could have been bad. Carl, did you make me any coffee? You were close. E for effort, sir. E for effort. All right, let's go back down. We'll check out this first room first. Shh. Be quiet, sir. This has got to be the banyo. Check and make sure there's nobody behind the doors on these. Again, the main reason why is I'm just trying to make sure that nothing shows up and crawls up the ladder behind me. All right, we're good on these. Being able to walk... A nice little candlelit bathroom here. Somebody... Dude... Screamer dude over here lit a candle. What do you think he did in here? I can tell you whatever it was, it wasn't pleasant, pleasant if he had to light a candle. You're a bad, bad zombie. We should be... Yep, we, we are. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, hang on. Hey. Butthead. Butthead. 
Genosis, you're kind of in the way. You're going to get shot. That's one reason why I don't do drones as often. Just because they like to hang out right in front of you. I didn't want to switch to anything that was going to make a lot of noise. So I was trying to stay silenced as much as possible. What are you? Titanium legs? That's heavy armor. I'm, I'm trying not to do heavy armor. I've got a full stack of... I've got my... Hold on, there's a bird right there. That's not a bird. That's a... <laughs> shh, you didn't see anything. Mr. White. Thanks for the reminder to reload my gun. He looks like he's got a broken neck. And that's going to go up to the tippy top. Is there anything even up here? There better be something really good up here. Air traffic control, you are clear for landing. You're clear for giving me some loots? Nothing. All right, well, let's stick our head up here and see. I bet there's a bird up here. I bet there's a bird up here, if anything. Yep. Aha! Why can't I hit you? <laughs> Get the one that's asleep. I can hit it. Cheese and rice, man. So we got lightly, just barely dinged. Construction boxes, probably going to be, yeah, stuff like that. I'll take it because it's mine now. But it's not that great. Ooh, another titanium auger. I've got a couple of those. Sweet. Ooh. Okay. Let me freeze that munitions box. With Oh, nice. We needed that so I don't have to take out of my main stash. Sweet. Thank you, Burbs. Appreciate you having some ammo for me. Is there a way? No, there's nothing up there a little bit higher. Okay. So now we can start making our way down the tower. I did check you already. Nothing in there worth getting. That's the second room. This is the room we came up, came in at. All right, so now we're in uncharted territory. Danger, Will Robinson. Where? And right there. Make sure you're reloaded. Okay, come on out. Trying to go for the headshots because, you know, they do more damage, but he's all up in my grill here. Tom, is that you in here all by your onesies? Are you hiding anything? You are. Nice. I haven't checked a single painting since we've come in this place. And the first one I check, it's got some loots behind it. We'll see if it's got anything good in it. I mean, it was a purple Tom. It's got to be good stuff, right? A uh, book I don't need and ammo for a gun I'm not using. Okay, well, I can at least break it apart if nothing else. Did you have anything hidden back here? No, you did not. I'm glad I found some more 44 ammo for this gun that I'm using because it's helping out a lot. What's up, Frank? You big beefer. Headshot. I see Carl hanging out over there in the corner, too. Why don't we have two big old beefers here at the same time? I'm going to shoot you right in your butt talks. Now stand up so I can shoot you in the back of the head. Don't blow up, sir. I need your loots, though. Ooh, nice. More. Check that out. Well, that is almost up to a full stack. Yeah. Can scrap you. You'll be good to have. Regular sh I'm going to take all of it, of course, because it's mine now. But yeah. Okay. Um, Where do you go? Where are we? Oh, we're ground level. Okay, all right, so we're at... we're Okay, so right around there is the main entrance. Yeah, the front of this place. Is this door open? No. Can I open this? I guess we can try to do it our way again. Some of these POYs that are designed specifically for Darkness Falls, they don't have a 100% designated way you're supposed to go. You know, it's not like super duper obvious where you can go. You got to try to make your own path a little bit. And I'm totally cool with that. If I can find the right path, I will. But if I just need to unlock a door and call it good, I'll do that too. Hey, listen. I'm listening. Eh. Eh. There's a bunch of glowy thingies over there. Okay, well, let's uh, peek over here and make sure there's none on this side first so they don't come up from behind. Yep, there's one. Shh. You jump like a maroon. Shush, dude. Hush your whole face. I'm so glad when they start screaming they don't wake up the other zombies because they're really loud. 
There's one. I see Sylvia laying down. Let's see if we can get a couple of good shots on her before she wakes up. She's down. <laughs> it sounds like a spaghetti western in here. Just ricocheting bullets off everything. Look at all these boxes in here. All right, so if worst case scenario happens, we can hoof it, jump. We don't have a fence over there. We can nope all the way out of here if we need to. Let me know if there's anything coming, okay? Let's see, food and water. Let's make sure our food and water is okay. Let's have some orange tea. That'll help out with the whole wellness up a little bit there. We're good on there. Some, a bowl of murky water if I absolutely have to have it. We're good. Health is good. Life is good. Stamina is good. We're going to check out this. We'll start this direction and make our way over. We're into the underbelly of this place. No, I don't need you. Doesn't look like there's anything in the corner. Nothing over here. Again, I'm not too worried about doing things like all these trash things around here. Yeah, you can totally get some stuff there, but I'm absolutely going to be chunky. ASAP. Um, okay, we'll go back this way just a smidge. I want to make sure I don't miss anything first. A map. Nice. And money, a beaker, titanium hunting knife. I'll just scrap you because you're not worth that much. An extra beaker. Fortunately, they'll stack and it's more money. Sweet. Check all these boxes over here. I'm going to guess we're going to get a bunch of bones and a bunch of nasty meats. Surprisingly, we didn't. We got clay. We got one blueberry seed. Uh, let me see. I don't need you. Tell you what. How about we do this? There's a couple things I know I don't need to have on me right this second. Tell you what. Let's eat... The bags of dried fruit, that'll give us a little bit of health, or food. That'll clear up a couple spaces. We can eat the peanuts. I'm just going to leave the water behind. The little bit of cloth, a little bit of coal, I'll leave you behind. Wood, I'll keep with me just because you're doing all right. I'll, re I'll read you. I don't need you being marked as the active one here, so let's just go ahead and unmark you for a second. Um, that'll, we, we're still good on inventory space. I'm just trying to maintain here. Do you have anything that I can do a quick stack in of things? Just a couple. Okay, cool. All right, well, we're making our way. That door's unlocked. Is anything, oh, hang on, what are you? Random cardboard box with, nope. Leave the dies behind, behind, behind. There was a little bit of a lag, uh, lag spike right there. A little bit of frame drop. Where does this go? I don't trust this. I don't see anything right at the moment. I do. Oh crap! Look on the look on the map. Oh hey, there's a bunch of red things. Look on the map. Big giant spidery looking thing right over there in front of the place. Um no. Okay game, please don't do anything stupid like spawn in a bunch of zombies right around me just because there's none currently right here. I don't want to get over here and then all of a sudden it's like, ta-da, you're around a bunch of zombies. Please. Just let's just keep this fair. Let's just keep this fight fair, okay? We're gonna grab all this stuff here. I'm just here for the loots. I promise. If you leave me alone, I Okay, I'm not gonna promise that. If you leave me alone, I will be quiet when I shoot you. How about that? Put you out of your misery quick and easy. Yeah, level 80. Now we can do the whole skill tree thingy up here in the technology tray. We got this one. Boom. It actually unlocked. Uh, unlocks recipe for laser multi-tool, which I have right here. Laser workbench, which I'm going to have to have a workbench to make. Fusion forge, laser battery mod. Okay, so since I actually learned it, hang on. Laser workbench. See, I need the laser workbench to make this one, or I need... Metal workstation. I can make, I can get this, this, those I have. That's what I'm missing, the portal power source. Yeah. Either need the portal power source or I need a laser bench to make a laser. Yeah. I, I Haha, <laughs> game, you're funny. You're hilarious. You're locked in here with me now. What's up, Tim? Danger, Will Robinson. Eh, he's not in... Wait, he's in danger. Yeah, good call. Good call. Good call. He's the one that's in danger. Got a spider zombie creeping around right over there. We missed. Shoot him through the chair a few times. Don't wake up, big mama. We're going to get all of us in trouble. Get all of us in trouble. Hang on, big mama. Don't do anything crazy. Sounds like you're getting crazy. 
know what they say, you're never going to survive if you don't get a little crazy. Titanium gloves, some stock, nice. Ooh, free food. Free food. Bag of trail mix. Uh, you know what, I'm just going ahead. Since that only, ooh, nice, efficient digestion, that'll help out there. Bag of dried fruit, I'll go ahead and use you. These plus fives and plus fives are not too bad because then I can use them and save some inventory space. Coffee. <laughs> nope. Look at that, lined up on it perfectly the first try. More shotgun shells, sweet. When the time comes, not if, when the time comes, we have to go loud and proud. Uh, we're, we're doing okay on the ammo we're gonna need for that. Let's crack into these shamway boxes and see if we got anything good in here. How's time? Time's good, it's barely after lunch. More dried fruit. Not sure why you need an entire box for one bag of trail mix. Uh, sure, you'll stack, wait, you don't stack. That's why I only have 10 with me. Okay, well, I guess you're coming with me. Wait, hang on. Before I do that, let me crack this one open real fast and make sure there's nothing over here that I can't get a good look at. Sylvia? Nah, I'll shoot you in the head. Oh, good. That's for your legs. I did say I would put you out of your misery without, you know, being crazy if you would be leave me. Hey. Shh. Is that... Hang on. Okay, we clear on this side. Some cracker books. Nice. Sorry, I didn't mean to have to blow up your chair, sir. You look like you're sleeping comfortably. Both of those are cool. Did you make me any coffee? No, you didn't make any freaking coffee either. What do we have? Coil gun parts. Okie dokie. Interested what's going to be in these uh, cracker book boxes over here. If nothing else, I can get the notes for them. Nice. More 44 ammo. Sweet. We'll have to repair our gun here in just a little bit. Ooh. Oh, okay. Hold on. I see. We're, we're cr coming up on a cracker book here. Cool. Well, thanks, game. I could definitely use all the... Oh, nice. I'll scrap you, scrap you, and scrap you. Scrap you. Shotgun notes. I'm, I can scrap you and scrap you as well. Nice. Give me a bunch of those notes here. If I can't seem to find myself a survivor master class book that I can buy from the trader, I'll just make me one. Scrap, 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 and scrap you. Scrap, 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 scrap. Uh, I'll read you. Just get our archery up by a little bit. Up by two. That's good a little bit here. Scrap, scrap, and scrap. Nice. That'll put us at... 30, 40, something like that. That's 40 here, plus you're locked. All right, well, let's go back around the other direction. Trying to be methodical to make sure we clear, like, all the places. Oh, no. Nah. Did you reload your gun lately? Yeah, yeah, I did. Hold on, we wait for Tim to stand back up. Good job, Tim. Good job. So why passing gas on the third floor of an airport? Seems kind of weird, but okay. There's Eddie over there in the corner. Keep an eye on things before I start looting things. I need to see what my opposition is. Let's see if we can get a sneaky shot on him. We did. And he went all to pieces. Ching, ching, give me some coinage, man. With two cash registers that haven't been looted yet. That's rare. Titanium Fire Axe is not as good as the one I have, but I can always use it to upgrade mine a little bit. Free food laying on the floor. Nice. I like the, like I said, I like those rations because you can just straight up eat those without any problems. And they usually give you a pretty big bonus for it too. All right, we got a wall on our side here. So let's see if we can't keep it to our backs and see. Oh, look, hey, there's that wall of furniture that was on the other side from where we came in. All right, so we are at another terminal. <laughs> Got anything good in here? You got nothing in here. Not even anything bad. Wait, wait, wait. Don't say that, Cap. We don't want bad things. We don't want the bad things. I am not going out there. We know what happened the last time I walked out on one of those little gangplanks. Little gangways. He caused a problem. Oh, God, I saw that stack of rock right there, and I thought bad things were about to happen. I thought bad things were about to come for cap. What? Hang on. 
Lisa, I need you to be real quiet, real, real quiet, okay? That shot. Dude. Got some breakdancing skills, did you see that? Oh wait, you already did. My bad. Sorry, I didn't mean to in add insult to injury. Sweet. See Lois back there trying to get her read on. Lisa, I'm not sure why you're working behind the counter. And, hey! I'm sorry, I wasn't insulting you. I wasn't saying you don't know how to read. I said I don't know why you're working over here. Wait, no, I wasn't even talking about you. Never mind. Maybe I was insulting you. Uh, Coil shoddy. I've got one. I'm leaving the canned foods behind. I'll take you. And you know what? I'll go ahead and use one of those just to kind of top off what we have. Actually, you know what? I'll take both of those. They're mine. Another register that we can actually search. Some free freaking money. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I'm going to guess there's more crap over that direction. So let's get these bookshelves searched first. All right, that's all the books that we can find over there. We are as chunky as one can get, so let's go through and scrap some of these that we... I just did a quick pickup on all these. Scrapped a couple of the ones that I saw that were definitely already open. Uh, things like that we're not going to need. We don't need that. Scavenging notes we don't need. Don't need that. Don't need that. Pistol notes. Nope. Archery. Maybe. Automatic weapons. I think we're okay. Safe cracking. Safe cracking. And rifle notes. Let me see where we are in terms of rifle. Rifle weapons, I should probably read those. And automatic weapons, let's see where we are in terms of those. I think we're there. Yeah, we're at 100 on those, so I can scrap those. And archery, we'll go ahead and read those. I'm close enough now. What I could do is run out to the gyrocopter, put a bunch of this stuff in there. I could actually like drop a quick chest on the ground and put pretty much all of this crap in there quick. And then before we leave, we can figure out what I absolutely have to have, what I can leave behind, that sort of thing. You know, because I've got a bunch of stuff here. I don't want to, but I'm only two spots away from being chunkified again, so I might as well. The question is whether I can get there and back without getting wrecked by another wandering random horde. All right, where, Genosis, where you is? Let me see. We can do a quick stack on you of stuff that we have that'll, that's it, huh? That, that's all you can hold. We'll put you in there and yeah, that's about it. All right, follow me. Okay, here's what we're going to do. We're going to do something really dumb. Please don't fall. There it goes. Oh, okay, it was just the floor that was falling. All right, no zombies out here. No zombies out here, okay? I just need to be able to get inside. To my gyrocopter. Hey, there is a fence over on that side. I guess it was just the way the game was rendering last time. I couldn't even see that. Let's see how much space you have. That I... See one random idiot over there. Do I have any wood on me? I do real quick here. Chest. We're gonna do this the we're gonna do this the smart way. Smartish way. This will be a problem for future cap. We're gonna put you, let me see, I need you down here, and then all of that I'll put up here. Let's see, we to make sure I'm taking all my ammo. I've got my Molotovs with me. Food and water's good. Is there anything I have to have that I didn't carry with me? Contact grenades, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and throw those over there just in case. Food and water is okay. I think we're actually... Let me go ahead and just drink you real fast. Do I have any more 44 ammo in here? No, I do not. Okay. Let's get back over to where we just were and continue on through this little journey. And we got a full... Uh, we're good to go on space now, so I can just kind of ransack things. I'm going to guess that if I jump through, if I go through the way I did in the last one, everything's going to fall apart again. So we're just going to go back up the way we came. Okay. We, we're been, we've been doing okay. Wait, hang on. I didn't check the rest of these stairs and stuff over here, these seats. We could have some problems. Are there stairs or anything over here? Hang on, let's make sure there's not anybody laying down out there. It doesn't look like it. All right, so we're good on this one. We've got... That's an elevator shaft. This... By the way, this is the other side of the wall that we were just on earlier. We... Have been over here? I think so. Uh-uh. Nah. Nah. See? See? Nah. I don't think so. That's just, um... Wait, how do I... Do you go somewhere? 
let, let me let me let me up here. Can you still climb these? No, you cannot. That just goes down inside, which is is there any reason to be inside besides the little purse? Money. I'll go ahead and take that with me. Okay, so that takes me out onto the roof, which we oh, we looked at earlier, so that's not where we need to go. Hey, let, let me back up here. Come on. Oh, there's a door back here we didn't go in. I'm going to assume this is the right way to go. Nailed it! Uh, wait a second. Oh, okay, so this led back around to over... Alright, so... Where... Oh, this was upstairs. Okay, so we still have this... In, we have this door over here. Alright, we're in a new area now. Some gas. Sure, I'll take all of that. Try. I don't see anything right this second. That's pointing that direction, so let's go over here. Quietly. Easy does it. Don't do anything dumb. Don't do too many things dumb. I'm going to grab the gas out of here before y'all have a chance to blow it up and kill me. We have stairs going down. A couple body bags laying around. I don't see any zombies down there at the moment. But these idiots like to hide amongst their own. So let me see if I can get a good look here. Wait, where do you go? I think I see one right back there before we open that up. That looks like we're we're like in the underbelly. This is like where the mechanics work and do their thing. That looks like where baggage comes down to load into the planes. Got some double doors here going. Okay, so we're ground level. Oh, hey, Tim. Hey, listen. Shh, I, stop screaming at me. You screaming listen and my ears not helping. Okay, we'll worry about you in a minute. Oh, it's nice being able to walk over sound traps and not accidentally trip them. Ooh, we could jump out this way if we had to. That's a quick emergency route. Always know a way out. That's a demon. Right there's a demon. I can see his face all glowing. He looks like he's pissed off and sunburned at the same time. But fortunately, our beastly pistol here that has been absolutely wrecking zombies since we got here does a real good job of taking down demons quickly. Everything else, sometimes it takes a little bit more than one shot. But demons, it can handle. I realize, by the way, as you know, y'all probably watched already the first video and you're like, hey, Cap, by the way, this method that you're using right now is exactly how you're going to have to go about doing the rocket facility. You're going to have to be a little quiet, be as sneaky as possible, take your time, use silenced weapons. If I had thought about it, I believe I have one more silencer at the house or I could just make one. And what I could do is put it on my coil rifle that I have, and then I can get some long-range shooting done. Oh, good. You know, besides just with the pistol. And that would definitely help out a lot. We'll backtrack and see with the other stuff here. I'm just trying to make sure we clear to all the things first before terrible things show up. There's a lot of construction worker zombies in here. I can shoot you right in the spine. Stay down, dude. Whoop, that one was a little high. That one's on me. That one's on me. What'd you bring me? Good loots? You brought me a crappy iron shovel and some duct tape. That's not good loots. That's bad loots. Got you and your buddy down. That was pretty dramatic, Glenn. It's pretty dramatic, I gotta say. A couple doors up over here on the left. Let's try, I'm trying to make sure there's nobody on this side of the truck here. Man, we need to, I need to kind of, oh sweet, that don't happen very often. I need to kind of pick up the pace a little bit here. I'm going slow and careful and trying to be cautious and do things the right way, but 
we're going to end up having to make this a three-day trip now. Now, I realize, too, sometimes POIs are just made to take very long. You know, like if you're going to try and take on Deshong, I mean, that's a three-day POI easily. Okay, you're unlocked. You're unlocked. You're locked. Oh, God, that looks like a really bad place to accidentally fire a round off. All right, let's go back this direction because clearly this is the way it wants us to go. Look at all these shopping carts we could be searching here, too. Check out the, with the... Uh-oh. Hang on, we're making a bunch of noise. Hey, listen. I am listening. There's an imaginary wall right here. I can't see who I'm... Owen, you big maroon. You can't run over those, sir. You cannot run over those. Let's see what's on the other side of this real quick. Bad dog. Bad, bad dog. Easy does. Bad dog. Good dog. I'm not sure which one. Okay, let's check the machines that we have here first. We'll take the stuff from those because we at least get some things we can use. Did the dogs make me any coffee? No, they did not. Shocking, but still disappointing. Forged iron's always good to have, and some extra cement. Sweet. Okay. We got this little spot right up in here. Yeah, we just totally glitched through the wall. Oh, there's a whole lot. There's still a lot of zombies in here. Popped his top. Y'all stay over there and be quiet for a second. I'll be back to deal with you guys in just a tiny little minute here. Come on, Cap. Keep your aim. Keep your aim about you. This door opens up, goes back over that way, so we'll leave it open in case we need to get out. You brought me some trick-or-treating bags. Titanium shovel and some electric parts. Appreciates that. Where do you go? Okay. Did you reload your gun lately? Nut shot. Oh, we missed. Nut shot. I, f I am very, being very, very cautious because I feel... Y'all remember yesterday when we was at the front of the building and we saw the tentacles on the uh, radar? Are we sticking through the wall? I'm very, very fearful that I'm going to stick my head up and we're going to find it. Oh, my God. This place is huge. Let's see. I can still see that on the outside of the map. I just can't imagine that good things are going to come for Cap. As soon as I get near that, it's going to be game over. I've never fought one of those, so I don't even know what to expect. Hey, where'd you go real quick? Do you have... I think I put a couple in you. Yes, you do. Sweet. I need one of those. I need to go ahead and repair this. It's starting to get a little bit low. Sweet. There we go. All right, let's uh, let's make our way back over here. We're going to have to not... I am not going to be able to finish this in just two days. It's not happening. That was pretty dramatic, too. Look at that. I had time to reload and time it took you to get up. This Okay, so all of this is behind the wall of where we were just clearing things out. So we just need to move around this direction. Have we been in here? Yes, we have. This is where Giant Sylvia was. Okay. All right. So, all right. Good. That makes me feel good because we're at least moving in the right direction to... All right. And then this puts us right back over here. And I'm going to guess that those doors open up right back over here. Make sure there's nothing behind me. All right. Good. If they're looping back around to the same places where I've already been, then at least I know that direction is clear. Hey, listen. Hush your face. One to the sack, two to the neck. I know I didn't need to reload that, reload that time, but I did anyway. Popped his top. Whoops. Oh, hey, I'm sorry, man. I didn't see you there. I saw you. You're not dead, but I saw you. Sure, I'll search you since you're right in front of me. No, I don't want your crappy t-shirt. I just don't want it. And you take me up to... Hey, guys. Can you not? Hey, you're a demon. I need to get rid of you first because you regenerate really fast. There's a lot of freaking construction workers in this place. Holy cow. I guess that's just so you can get a drop on them. I don't know why. 
I don't know much, but I know that makes no sense. Okay, so you lead back over here. Oh, we got another door over here. Where? Oh, God! Okay, that's a big egger. That's a big one. And there's... Okay. Make sure we're good. Okay, we're not good for a second. Hang on. Don't blow up, dude. Giant Edgar is blocking the way here. Oh, You dill hole, Gary? Oh, Giant Edgar is blocking the way. Nothing coming up behind... Hey, no, sir. I said no. Lay down. I'm going to use some first aid. Yes, I could have switched over to a different weapon, but you know what? I was being quiet. And sometimes you got to be quiet. And we've been... I didn't want to wake up everybody else in the entire vicinity here. Oh, how did you not wake up? I don't know. Two shot at you like a boss. Ooh, has my mask, some research notes. Sure, I'll take all of you. Grain alcohol, I need that in order to make something. What? I know there's something that I was using grain alcohol to make, but I can't remember what it was now. Was it, what was it? I can't even remember. Oh God. Um, how about, how about, how about we don't do that right this second? That seems like it could be really, really bad. Oh, I didn't even see what he got me. Gothic pants. <laughs> Edgar. Um. Oh, good. Just in time for everything to start running. Oh, I thought I was going to be able to cheese that all to pieces, man. Cheese it to pieces. A little bit of cashola up in there. Can we hide back under? Ooh, we can. Uh, can't sneak through there, though. This would be a good place to hide for the night. Or upstairs. What is going on in here? Oh, there's a Carl. Is he a demon? I... Okay, so I can't shoot the tentacles. I feel like climbing up there would be a big trap. Is there a way to get inside this place besides opening this door? Which is locked. We could do... No, I can't do that because your giant tentacle is in the way. If you'd, if you'd move it out of the way, that'd be great. Uh-oh. Hang on. We have a B&E in progress. Look, I don't work here. But I will try to protect this area. Hold on, I think we have a small horde showing up over here. I see a glowing dude right tall. Oh, that sounds like... Is there a full wandering horde out here? Or is it just the one? Okay. Okay, alright. Actually, what I need to do is not go get locked up in there. What I need to do is hang out in here. Okay, I did not think that this place was going to be a three-night looting spree. I really did not think it was going to take... I don't know what I thought it was, how long I thought it was going to take to get through here, but it did not think it was going to take that long. Wait, can I go up from this little spot? Where do you go? Huh, there's a flashlight pointing this way, so... Oh, okay, so that's that little front area over here. We got a couple boxes. We'll search these real quick. Nice. Some titanium nux. You know what? I can sell those. Gunpowder is always nice. Yeah. And some more stuff I can scrap down. Heck, yeah. Well, okay, guys. Uh, this looks like a pretty good stopping point. Look, this place has been insane. There's a whole lot going on here still. I would really rather not risk it by allowing everything to already run more than it is. So, am I playing cowardice? Absolutely. Am I alive still? Currently. We're going to do this. We've got to be getting close to finishing up here. So probably day 67, we'll finish this other one up and then we can head home and hopefully we can actually take all of our loot with us because we got a lot. We'll have to do some sorting of stuff out in the uh, out in the gyrocopter before we leave. I need to grab all of that. I might as well just take it with me and I'll put you up in there and that's about it. Anyway, guys, that's going to do it. If you enjoyed the video, do me a favor, leave a like on it. If you're new here, make sure you subscribe if you're not already. In the meantime, you guys have a wonderful day. Now, I'll talk to you later.